All right, guys, what's up? What's happening, baby? What's happening, Captain? As y'all can see, Live HD. It's your host with the most Paul can too. Now, I would do this intro outside, but it's like raining, it's thunderstorming, and all of that, so it's a problem. But basically, what I have today is a brand new concept where I'm thrifting every single day this week, making a video every single day this week, and also trying to update my website every single day this week. We'll see about all that because that's a lot of work. But, bro, I figured there's some blue collar motherfuckers out here working like 512s, 6 12 hour days. And I'm like, dude, if I applied that mentality to thrifting, my potential would be limitless. <laughs> so, anyways, yeah, welcome to Beast Week. Um, it is Monday. This is episode one. And we're just gonna see how much fire I can accumulate at the thrift for the low. So uh, let's go GI bro and see what they got. All right, my guys, we're in the first spot right now. Obviously, Goodwill, and you guys know mask on for all that protection. I only found one clothing find in the men's section. So yeah, this store has been a hot steaming pile of multicolored rave shit. But I think I still am gonna get this all embroidered, clean little Harley Henley. I love the back of it. But check this out, dude, in the abstract like toy section. Bro, 1990, you got bubbles, the bubble blowing, a tricycle riding friends, um, bubble maker. This thing is sick, circa 1990, dude. This thing looks so fire. Just the packaging in and of itself, it's like three bucks. So why not, bro? These fools tweaking. Let me dig in the bag of the reefer though. Yo, my guys, look at this beanie, bro. This thing goes too dummy. The SpongeBob, it's like to who dollars? <laughs> Instacop, man. Hey, they got a little Houston Astros Majestic T. I might get it. It's like two as well. Shout out that owl. <laughs> I also got those uh, military lunch boxes right here, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> These hold those little brass burritos. <laughs> Guys, so look at this jacket. You got the damn gator in the blueberry color scheme. You have the beautiful Lacoste uh, jacket right here. Super old school Lacoste alligator tag on that dude right there. Man, this is fire. Also, I hit like an Adidas jackpot. Jackpot. You got vintage Adidas short shorts. You know, you can tell by, by the flags on the tags. Another Adidas essential, the Adidas skateboarding low-key soccer jersey vibe. Got the white just gradient into the black. This thing is absolutely beautiful. You already know, man. We got a lot of cops in here. Oh, then for the children? Bro, the old school Adidas Adiprene? The only thing is, these are bottomless. Oh my God. Bro. This is like a bad flashback to the Nike Cortez incident I had last week. Got me. <laughs> I wish you guys could touch this, man. It's like stroking uh, cookie monsters, you know what I'm saying? Cock. Uh, <laughs> no, but for real, man, this is ferocious. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, bitch! Well, I'll be damned. Hey, check this out, man. For you big boys, we got that double XL bagel, sandstorm type of color scheme. Tommy for your mommy hill figure tee. This thing is so soft that I have to grab it, dude. I think they're charging like six bucks for it, which is tax trippy, but I need it. All right, guys, we're in line right now. And uh, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw my Instagram story highlighting this Coors Banquet Vintage 90s thermos glass right here. And this is a, this is American spread, goddammit. You got the Lone Star beer, little thermos cup. You got that Harley Henley. You got the Coors Banquet, baby. America's fine. Light beer. Miracle. All right, guys, we're out of goodwill. Yeah. Bro, I'm telling you, man, that store had that fire. And I'm sorry that my lens is getting foggy, bro. It's like a rainforest out here. It's hot and humid, bro. It's moist, bro. Anyways, guys, dude, I got an unbelievable amount of stuff in that store. What's up, daddy? Hey, B Sweet starting off right. Oh, it's foggy on my lens. Damn. Versace sweatpants, swordfish. swordfish. All the size my neck gave me a sore wrist. All right, guys. Yo, I just want to tell y'all, I am so happy that that last store came through, the first one. We're at yet another Goodwill. I feel like I'm on my, like, classic thrift trajectory, but, bro, I got to piss like a motherfucker. That's why I love Goodwill. They got public restrooms. Will this get me demonetized? Fuck it. <laughs> Let's see if this store hits as well. All right, guys, check this out, dude. This is insane, but in the sneaker section, they have all of these, like, Cole Hans and Joseph Arbaud, like, fancy kind of formal shoes. And they're all, like, my size, which is wild. This green rendition of these loafers is nuts. Bottom of these looking like some damn track shoes. These look hella cozy, though. 
So I don't know what all I'm gonna get. I mean, you got avocado color schemes, you got green beans, you have the gray Kohans. There's just so many shoes. They're all like 17 to 20 bucks. I'll have to really look through and see what they got. Maybe they got some Clark sitting in the mist. But yeah, this isn't typically like the sneakers I'm into, but these all have value and they're probably super cozy. So I'm gonna check them out and see what they got. All right, guys, this is what I'm grabbing, bro. These go straight insane. They have the Lumiani Chelsea boots. I love Chelsea boots, number one. They just look so swagtastic when you have a slightly formal fit. Um, they are my size, my guys. I do believe they're like 12 or 13, bro. I don't, I don't know Italian sizes off the dome like that. But these are super sick, so I'm gonna grab these. All right, speaking of little fancy and formal shoes, look at these like Gucci moccasins. Jesus, they have like camel suede again, a nice bagel kind of color scheme. They look like a lightly toasted piece of bread. Um, delicious gum bottoms right there. They're $34.99, not too shabby. With the Gucci little lid, they're actually my size. Um, they have these little wooden dangly balls on them, paws. And then it has all of the, I guess, Gucci um, paperwork Perfect. in here as well. So I'm gonna have to look these up and see what's happening with them. Got the little dust bag as well. But yeah, based off the amount of formal shoes that are donated um, in the embroidery, they look clean. They look clean. They look clean. No, you is blind. I'm not blind, you blind. I'm gonna have to clean up this little side skirt on the shoe, but I am going to grab these for the dub, bro. Just know that. We got Gucci in the thrift. Sway. All right, so enough about shoes. Back to the clothes. Bros, look at this beautiful 90s pastel hunt club button up a classic i gotta nab it bro you can have it like unbuttoned with a little t-shirt popping out or just buttoned all the way up tucked into some light wash levi's come on daddy come on hikey fire look at that h town texas brazewood baby it is h town texas brazewood baby got the houston rockets adidas hoodie um it is more like charcoal in red a little faded due to age but super cool i like that like centerfied logo that's not a word dang dude someone went in on the custom easter shoes fire oh my god why is she lying here like this bro look at this super old mini mouse why did they rip the price tag off of my girl like this bruh What's the price? Prices, prices going up. hopefully they can give me a nice price on it. I don't I don't know what the price was, but man, these damn scammers in the thrift, dude. Trifling. <laughs> hey, designer sneakers, Gucci loafers. I'm swagging casually, you feel me? Designer shoe with Gucci loafers, I'm swagging casually. Bro, okay, we got the box in here right now. You know, the little Gucci's. Um, check these out. Okay, they were $35 not too bad sorry i'm like struggling in my car but it's pouring down raining outside all right so as you guys can see man these are size 12 they were sold at 200 dollars i don't know at what store but they were discounted um and they're from 2007 they're the moccasin pelly s gomas suede soft sand colorway so when i say sandstorm bro y'all know i'm not playing but yes my guys this is what I'm talking about, bro. This is why I go to thrift stores. This shoe is in absolutely pristine, flawless condition. It is a nice soft sand. <laughs> Gucci um, moccasin. It has the little balls on it. It's size 12 and a half. I wear size 12. We got the golden Gucci, all gold everything on the booty right there, a little tramp stamp. And then where the price is, uh, let me move it there is the gucci insignia right there so i can't wait to slide into these i actually might sell them um or try to sell them if no one buys them then i'll keep them that's the same thing i did when i found versace shoes bro is no one wanted to pay up so i was like bet i just wore them to weddings and stuff bro so yeah um and then you have this shoe right here obviously it got that nice little tread mark on it that tire track i guess this dude did get hit by a car or two in his time on the earth but yeah these are sick man so i had to grab those shoes bro this is what i'm talking about bro beast week is coming through for can too you dig got the gucci moccasins man feeling like a designer native american if that offended anyone i'm sorry but pocahontas a good ass movie it's historically inaccurate i'm woke six chains six bitches on my own call me rick james i'm dirty dancing with that bitch. hello guys all right so we're in the next spot right now and the only reason i'm doing this like horrible accent oh it's horrid 
It's because you got the Oxford University, baby. Straight out of England. Ha, cozy boy, little hoodie. You got another cozy vibe in that baby blue. Ha, and then look at this. To complete the fit, you got the Polo Ralph Lauren shorts, dude. Like, all things are cozy in here. And yeah, dude, we're in yet another Goodwill. So this is like a Goodwill rampage happening today. Dang, that chair, hella medieval. Oh, crispy and philosophical. Look at this, you got the all white Arian Foster jersey. Bro, Arian Foster was a beast. High formation, Foster again, left side, wide out across the 20, the 15, the 10, going for the five, going for the pylon. Touchdown, Arian Foster! My camera is not doing this colorway justice, dude. This is like a Dijon mustard, bro. You have the Wyoming Cowboys pullover right here. Oh. It's more like a soft sand, excuse me, if we're speaking in Gucci terms. Bro, you guys know I have to hit it every time I see it. Stroke, Stroke my cactus. cactus. It's lit. Oh my titties, guys. This colorway goes stupid. Look at that pink Nike Navy snap buttons. Bro. Come on, man. We don't do three stripes. Checks, Checks over, over stripes. stripes. Yeah, that's, that's what, what I, I like. like. Yeah, Look at this like. Nike crew neck. Crew neck. Wow. Heavy down jacket. Hold on. I gotta zoom in one time for the one time, bro. Hit that long stroke zoom, daddy. Look at that zipper, bruh. Embellished, shining, sparkling, and glistening. Dude, this thing is teched out. Man, hold up, bruh, bruh. Dude, somebody go ahead and give me the title thrift scientist because I dissect these stores, dude, and I identify that fire. But yeah, that store is loaded like a damn uh, bike with title. <laughs> but seriously, it had a lot of stuff and I am blessed. I don't know what it is. My good mood, who knows? But it's like when you find one thing in one store, the next stores just provide, dude. Blessed. Oh man, dude. <laughs> Let me turn down this music. All right, guys. Yo, we're in the next spot, which is Goodwill, and I hit a fat lick. Check out the card, all right? We got a ton of stuff. Sorry about the music, too. They're, like, really trying to get me a copyright strike, but we're starting off light, dude. First of all, you got this 90s striped beach little button-up. Crazy. You got these dope chubbies. Huh? Um, octopi encrusted shorts. Then a little essential, nothing too crazy. University of Kansas Jayhawks. Then you have the dub step, like lemon lime color scheme, vintage little baseball tee. You have the Air Jordan Gatorade tee with all the logos on the sleeve. And then on this side, it says, be like Mike, bro. That piece goes insane. Found a little essential Broncos, nothing too insane about that dude. And then you have another pair of chubbies right here kind of um skittle color scheme and then to match it scooby doo tee green looking clean look at this look at this you got the speed racer vintage tee and then another vintage banger is the genco um o to leonardo da vinci you know what i mean with the clean animation that fool got that tooth or hella of them genco right there bro made in usa guys very rare they have a six dollar vcr i never see these in the thrift and um popped in that classic rush hour banger peep game dude peep game dude look at that all right that's an insta cop and then you got the wires for like a dollar so i'm about to dip out of here but um a couple more finds i got this giant red tasmanian devil he's only like three bucks but he has like wires in his arms and legs so i think he's meant to be like mounted on something and then i found a houston dynamo you guys know got a rep to home city um a trucker hat adidas very cool and then you know to play on my new vcr even though i already have two of them i got the robin hood classic banger of a movie let's get it all right, y'all, I made it to the last spot of the day, which is yet another Goodwill. So this literally has been like a five-store Goodwill rampage. Um, yeah, so we'll see if this one comes through like all the other ones have today. I swear I'm blessed, bro. Let's go. All right, fellas, we in here. And God, I love essentials like this. You got the vintage Swingster made in, where is that? Kansas? 
damn world of wearables. I just like an essential green piece like this. You can rock it with a variety of fits. Also, they have an Adidas hoodie, essential once again. <laughs> they got a Harley rim, perfect. perfect. Um, and then they have the Tommy jeans, little fleece crew neck, which is also sick. That Tommy for your mommy, Thomas for your mother. And then uh, speaking of mother, look at this little mammy right here. Oh, she bad, you got the Betty Bopper with them sharp titty nipples. Um, and you also have Stewie as a wizard. So plush section is also coming through for your boy. <laughs> I straight saw this from across the store. You got the Tweety mug for two bucks. Woo! And all right, ladies and gentlemen, so we're back in the house right now, obviously. And just check out the spread of stuff that we have today. And some of the things I didn't even show you guys in this video, like we have this M&M dispenser that's super cool. I got this like 80s Texas A&M Rydell vintage um, football helmet, a couple of Nike lunch kits. I got um this sick glass set um all of different like beetles glasses right here in a goodwill as well and yeah i mean this is just day one of beast thrift week so yeah if you guys want anything thrift vintage.com is my website there's a lot of stuff in stock right now however all this stuff from today's video will probably be dropping on the weekend because i'm thinking i'm gonna take like the weekend to not shoot videos but instead it just lists literally everything on the site so we're gonna have some mega drops so follow the thrift heaven official instagram link in description check out my website link in description follow me on instagram link in description or don't do any of that but just like the video because i appreciate you guys flexing with me and making it to the end point of this thing but anyways man i'll see y'all tomorrow with day two of the beast thrift week let's get it man see ya and I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.